superscript, subscript, spans. Three S-words that also serve as the things we show on the screen to break down a lesson. We'll cover all three, starting with superscript. And it's important to make a semantic distinction here. Styling part of text to make it smaller and up on the top or bottom is not a good practice. Adding superscript to something isn't done in the style panel. Superscript involves a change to the HTML itself because it adds a tag called sub. Hey. Not you, Miguel, but I appreciate the enthusiasm. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So to add superscript, I can just select the text I want expressed as superscript and choose superscript. That's it. What about subscript? Subscript adds a tag into the HTML called sub. Hey. Same thing here. Select whatever you want to make subscript, then choose subscript. Finally, let's talk styling. You can still wrap superscript or subscript with a span. And when you do, you can build on top of these styles in the style panel. You can add CSS. But it's important that at the base of all of this, we build things on top of actual superscript or subscript. But that's adding superscript and subscript to text in the Webflow Designer.